What is going on, gentlemen? Today, we're going to talk about how to take part in these live streams at Hustlers Kung Fu and Disruptive Mail. And I'm also going to do it. It's going to be a little weird, but I'm going to explain why it's a little weird. So let's begin. First of all, this channel is dying. So I don't really care if I send traffic off of it. Disruptive mail is blowing up. So the way that YouTube works, and if you want to start a YouTube channel, in the beginning, do not send anybody to your social media. Don't send a lot of traffic. Don't really, I would say for the first six months, really don't send any traffic off of your channel. Uh, no social media, no, none of that. You want all the traffic to stay on YouTube because what will happen is YouTube will start to promote your videos. And that is extremely, extremely powerful i am making this video on this channel because it's already dying so if traffic comes off this ain't no sweat but because i'm sending traffic to this channel from disruptive mail it is making disruptive mail stronger and actually bringing this channel back so that's why it's on this channel and that's why the links will be from disruptive mail to here all right so the link below is how you sign up for the text notification squad. Just hit that link, and then you have to confirm because you're gonna sign up, you're gonna put your name, your phone number in there, right? Then you're gonna get a confirmation email or well, a confirmation text that you must say yes to or you will not get these streams. Also, I didn't put this in the title, but I'm gonna go over some courses and I'm gonna answer some questions. So this should be very, very interesting. All right, we got the Wild Jones report. Modding, Jay Fleming modding. Disruptive mail is the issue. <laughs> Y'all ain't even seen me cut up yet. That's what's funny. I've been restrained because I've been trying to test YouTube parameters. So that's one of the things. But to get on the disruptive mail text notification squad, you go below, click that link, go to my you know, it's, it's just going to be like a sign up form. Fill out your information, put your phone number in. And then when you get the confirmation email, say yes. And you'll be getting text from both of these live streams. You'll get text for Hustlers Kung Fu. You'll get a text for Disruptive Mail. All right. So let's um, get into some of this wonderful training. Because I get a lot of questions about this. And... Let's see, let's go here. All right. So a lot of you are asking about what's the best course to buy. Now, let's talk about a course on getting traffic. It, there will never be a course uh, from me on getting traffic because you need a platform to get traffic. There is no magic wiki, um, whatever you want to call it, that's going to get you traffic. You're going to have to get traffic through a collaborative effort of using a platform and leveraging that platform to get traffic. So there is no like, here's a $25 course to get traffic. Uh, where the courses to get traffic will be when I bring disrupt, well, when I bring digital citizen back online, that's where that stuff's going to be. And the only course that I'm going to have on how to build traffic is using YouTube. Because that's all. I don't do Facebook ads. I'm not going to create a course on how to do Facebook ads when I don't do them. And I'm not going to create a course. Well, I will do a course on how to use Google Ads words. I'll do that because I do that. And use YouTube and YouTube strategy. So that's going to be only traffic development courses I'm ever creating. And I'm going to tell you. This new strategy that I'm working on is working like gangbusters. So, because a lot of people are like, I don't want to do YouTube, man. I don't want to do YouTube. I don't want to show my face. I don't want to put my face out there, man. You got some? It's cheap. It's really inexpensive. Where I don't have to put my face out there, and I can make about like five thousand dollars a month. You know, and I mean, maybe for like fifty, ninety nine dollars. You got something like that? You got some? You know? Come on, people. Let's be real. If you're asking that kind of question, you are so unseasoned, it ain't fucking funny. All right, so back to the courses. All right, now for straight up beginners, you have no experience doing 
anything. You've never sold anything in your life. You've never done anything. You don't even know where to start. I'm going to keep saying this. And a lot of people, because it's kind of complicated. <laughs> it's very, very complicated. Because, I mean, you're going to have to do stuff when you take this course. 30 Days to 25, the original course. This is it. You're a ranked beginner. Because one of the things that you must learn before you start selling online is how to sell. One of the reasons that I've been so successful is I knew how to sell and market before I came online. It's like dating. If you know how to date really well without being online, man, you get online, you're going to crush it. You will crush it. You will knock it out of the ballpark. But if you don't have any scale, sales skills, any marketing skills, any people building relationship skills, 30 days to 2,500, which is probably going to take you 60 days to do. Yes, 60 days of your life. It's going to give you those skills. It's going to teach you how to market. It's going to teach you how to meet people and all of that, which is what I knew how to do before I came online. Many of you are trying to, quote, hack the process. Many of you are trying to be efficient to be effective well to be efficient and not waste any time but uh, a lot of you you're not wasting time doing that you're wasting time playing video games you're wasting time watching television you're wasting time chasing chicks you never ever gonna fuck you wasting time like that but this right here doing 30 days 2500 taking 60 days out of your life or maybe 90 if you're a little you got a lot going on you got kids family whatever I promise you, I guarantee you, if you do the work, you'll make way more money after this course than you paid for it. I mean, let's see, what, what do I have the course at? I don't even know. Let's see, what do I have it at? Pricing on this is 300 bucks. So with the, with the coupon, it's $150. You do this course and you make a G. You didn't come out so much fucking far ahead, but many of you have what I call unrealistic expectations. You want to spend like $150 or $200 and you want to make $100,000. You know what? In time, this course will actually get you there. But once again, the important component is you must work. You got to execute. I don't know how many times I'm going to keep screaming this because many of you are like, I took the course, man. And then I go in and I see you miss shit. You just went over like six modules. Then you got to the shit that you wanted to do. You must go from module one to module 27 without skipping the steps. And you must do everything to be successful. $150 today with the coupon, which is below. And you could get you a little hustle. And let's just say, you ain't really a star. Let's say you got so many problems that after this course, you making 400, 600 bucks a month consistently. That's 5,000 to 7,200 bucks a year from a $150 course. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Then there's next year where you make that. So in the course of three years, you can make like literally 30, 40 grand from a $150 course if you do the work. See, that's the catch. You got to do the work. That's the hang up. You got to do the work. But hey, there it is. All right. So what I'm going to do is go over a course and then I'm going to answer questions. And we're going to roll it like that. Uh, let's see. <laughs> What's up, Jermaine? All right. Let's see. Hold on. Okay. Mama needs one. Just finished watching your latest stream from Driss's Mail. I am curious to your take on Steve Harvey wifing up someone with multiple children. Yeah, we, we'll answer that over there. Yeah, we'll 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 answer that over there because I got to it. Uh, honey, bur honey, bunny, thirty days to twenty five hundred is the truth. Yeah, actually, go over there and put that on the last stream as a comment, and we could talk about it. Honey, bunny, an extra five hundred dollars a month is life changing for a lot of people. It is, but folks want to ball out they want to get that lambo in six months where usually if you can create a business and be able to buy a lambo in six years that's fast but you know it's a 250 to a five hundred thousand dollar car that you can't drive every day but people don't really understand that 
All right, so there are no questions, so I will go to the next course. So which will be a bundle? Let's do the bundle. So let's see, the best bundle is going to be the Never Broke Action Pack because it contains 30 days to 2,500. It contains 30 days to 2,500 physical products for you people who want to do Craigslist, offer up Facebook. That course will help you tremendously with that. Asking for the money. It's a sales course. Uh, Disruptive Money Personal Alternative Cash. How to Never Be Broke Again. The 24-Hour Startup. The Hustler's Mindset. Pippi Your Mind for Success. Audiobook. Hustler Kung Fu Webinars. This this right here. And let's see. What is this? It's $4.99. So for $2.50... You get all that, plus you get lifetime membership to Disruptive Mail Prep. I really, you know what? Uh, I'm raising that price. I'm not going to raise that price now because we got a special going on, but I am going to raise that price once I get Disruptive Mail Prep up and running and then add the folks there because that's incredibly, incredibly cheap for what you get teach you how to do a lot of stuff with that. So hands down, that is the best bundle. <laughs> hands down. That's it. That's it. Because if you don't have a lot of cash, I mean, my suggestion is you, you take the 30 days, the, you know, the never broke action pack, apply it for a few months, then come back and then get the corporate courses. Cause I am not lowering the price on those. Actually, the price of those will be going up because I'm going to add some more stuff to it. That's what you should do. You should get out, hustle. You should be hustling right now. You should be making money right now. You should be doing what you need to do right now because the this is ticking. This clock is ticking. And I'm telling you. What the hell? All right. That was weird. I don't know. <laughs> oh, God, I got a new iPhone. It's doing weird stuff. But anyway, that's funny. Uh huh. All right. I know what happened with that. I don't know why that is playing in my iTunes. All right. So let's see. Do we have a question? Uh, Alvin. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting in my creative. Oh, yeah. Um, just for you, for those of you who don't know, and you know, I, I tell you everything I do because we're going to talk about something else after I uh, get into the questions. Okay, this is my Instagram account, and I'm going to explain to you what I'm doing. I am putting up stuff here using a multitude of hashtags. And every day I try to put up two to six photos and I'm learning to space them out because, you know, I hit some people with like six that just floods up their stream. And this is incredibly powerful on teaching you how to create thumbnails for YouTube. Thumbnails for YouTube are crazy important. They are. So just go over here. Now, this one. I juiced this one up. I enriched the color because, I mean, this this is just a very powerful photo. I mean, he just looks like raw power, right? Well, I juiced that up and I put it on the thumbnail of Disruptive Mail. And that video got 1,100, 1,200 views in less than 12 hours on a brand new channel to tell you how important thumbnails are. When I get back to Digital Citizen, I'm going to have a thumbnail course. But before I have a thumbnail course, I'm actually going to make a lot of powerful thumbnails because there's, you know, I do it automatically, but there's like, God, what, 16 steps to this. And I've just perfected it because, um, you know, I, I'm going to put a lot of stuff in there. So be sure to follow me at Mac Daddy Media on Instagram. You because this is what I'm doing. I'm actually doing what I'm telling you to do. And a lot of people don't want, they're like, whoa, whoa, that's too hard. Well, fucker, that's what it is. That's what it takes to do it. I don't care if it's hard to you. That's what it takes. This is what you got to do. 
I was putting up stuff. I was posting stuff and I wasn't getting any followers for months. Now, this month, I've gotten close to 200 followers. And the month's like a little bit half over. 200. I mean, every morning I wake up, I get likes from new people. I get follows from new people because it's all about the hashtags. Also, um, you know, with the formatting of the images, uh, there's a lot that goes into this. And let's see. I wonder if y'all can hear that. Oh, you can't. You should go ahead and subscribe because this, this thing is cracking people up because uh, – I'm going to do another one because uh, there's there's a rhythm and madness to this. So you can like watch what I'm doing. I don't know if you're going to figure it out, but you can watch. So be sure to subscribe to Mac Daddy Media. All right. Let's see if we got any questions up in here. Any questions? <laughs> Alvin loves these thumbnails. MJ Electronics, the stream yesterday was great. Appreciate it. Beyond 337, commit to the material and execute, and the RI speaks to itself. Exactly, Beyond 337. Exactly. Because I, I'm going to just be real with y'all in a minute, because I'm going to go through these and make sure I get all these questions. Alter, how does all this work? Okay, uh, Alter, I'm not beating you up. Ask a better question, because what is this? I have no clue what you're talking about. So ask a better question. And the mods don't block him because I think he is from another country. So typically people from another country tend to be more blunt and they ask questions. So we're going to give Alter Beelzebub a chance to express himself. All right, Al. The Wild Jones Report. The right hashtags on Instagram are crucial. Yes, they are. Pretty much. Ben the bartender loved those apple emojis. Yeah, they're kind of addictive. What's up, Ray? Honey Bunny, I also found the time of day you got you post Instagram makes a difference. Although the recent algorithm changes have altered that a bit. I'm gonna say for me, it doesn't make a difference. And I've, it's it's kind of wild because I've posted in the morning, I post in the evening, and it when the image is hot and the hashtags are correct. It doesn't matter what time you post. People find it because I'm looking for people who are looking for certain things. They're they're actually going in and like looking for London or they're looking for because those are going to because that's how you get people to follow you without posting. Harold Lim. Hi, what is disruptive mail prep and how is it different from the main disruptive course? Thanks. All right, Harold. Uh, that's a good question. So let me get over in here. And oh, cool! I can duplicate this course. Awesome. Let's go to the sales page. All right. This is disruptive mail prep. <clears throat> what this is going to be, <clears throat> since uh, my other channel is, I don't think I'm going to get deleted because I'm watching myself. But I'm going to upload all of the videos from disruptive mail to this course. And I'm going to have three to four subscription tiers. I haven't really decided yet. Uh, the first tier is going to be $9.99. And what are you going to get? $9.99 per month. Now, what are you going to get from that? You're going to get all of those videos. Plus, you're going to get videos I can't put on YouTube. There will be some sexual stuff. There will be some strategies. There will be a dating course. There will be books. Uh, essentially... It's going to probably take me a good year, maybe two, to put everything on it. But it's going to be information that you will not be able to get anywhere. Like, for, I don't even know the name of the dating course because part of the dating course is you're going to have to write compelling ads. You're going to have to take better pictures. I posted a thing on Bumble. I posted a profile on Bumble, regular pictures, not so special um, bio. I ain't, no, no one match. Then I changed it up. I changed the pictures. I graded, I color graded the pictures. I put in a snazzy, well-written profile with a uh, challenge statement. And you know, I'll tell you what a challenge statement is when we get into it. And my results went from nothing to three to four a day. Same dude, just different presentation. So stuff like that. And you should check out, you know, it's, it's the, the course 
it's going to be much, much more substantial. It's going to be much, much bigger. It's going to be much, much more. Um, let's put it this way. The dating courses. And I say courses because if you're dating on Bumble, that is totally different than if you're dating on Plenty of Fish. And if you're dating on Plenty of Fish, that is totally different than you're dating on Match.com because each site has its own little quirks. Uh, like Bumble, one of the things that I've ascertained from Bumble, there's a lot of tall chicks on there. There's a lot of five nine, five eleven. There's a bunch of them on there. But Bumble has it set up where the woman makes the first overture. So this is naturally bringing more confident, more professional women. And it's very interesting. Like plenty of fish ain't like that. So each dating platform, I want to go on there. I'm going to figure out exactly what things you need to do. And I'm going to create a little mini course. So there'll be a course on Bumble. There'll be a course on Match.com. There'll be a course on Plenty of Fish. There'll be a course on Zusk. There'll be a course on Tinder, all that stuff. So that's going to be ongoing. And, you know, since I am, because like I said, because I know a lot of people, because I've done this before, are not going to get the lifetime special. <laughs> they're just not because they're like, yeah, he's full of it. But, you know, the first subscription tier is definitely going to be $9.99 a month. Then I'm going to probably go to maybe 24 where there's going to be other parts of game because I'm a great writer. And I don't say that to be elitist or to brag or to boast, but the stuff that I have written and I will be posting uh, scripts, you know, stuff you can copy and post, you know, make your ad pop. Oh, just a lot of stuff. It's, it's so much. Essentially, and then when we get into the mindset training, then we get into the personal development, because this is the place for all of that. So that's what's going on with that. Good question. Appreciate you. All right. Let's come back. All right. The Wild Jones report. Yes. Okay. Farrell, I never we got into using hashtags. How do you pick them and what prompted you to start using them? It's the way Instagram works. If you don't use hashtags other than people in your family or friends who follow you, your, your content will never get beyond your small circle. Hashtags are like keywords. You got to have them. Alter bees above. I'm asking, how does your program work when I'm sell? Actually, I told you that. Uh, wait until this finish and watch this again. I actually go into that because you got to find a product. I give you the system, but you got to find the product. Uh, the Wild Jones Report. What's a good alternative to Gumroad to sell digital items like eBooks and audio audiobooks? All right, uh, I'm going to do this. I think I'm going to give you what two things that I use think if it pricing is this is going to answer one of those other questions that someone was popping out uh, let's see come on all right I've been selling digital products so long that I am not going to use patreon or gumroad or any of that stuff I'm just gonna create my own sites so think if if they've got like a free thing but you don't get starter you don't get your own um, domain name which is super important if you're trying to sell a lot of stuff you're going to need to have your own domain name and then there is teachable teachable i really really like that's what i'm building disruptive uh, mail prep on so i host all my own stuff i do not um i i'm not doing any other other stuff because i just know how to do it you know once again, once I get to Digital Citizen, I'll be talking about this stuff in more depth. Oh, crap. All right. Uh, let's see. Let me do this again because I did not. All right. Hold on. All right. Here we go. All right. So this is teachable. Uh, I really, really love this site. It's very easy. It's very flexible. Um, think of if is not as to me because some people love think of it. Some people love teachable. I like teachable, 
but this is what I'm hosting all my stuff on. And this is what I would recommend that you put your eBooks and digital products on. You got to hook it up with your own uh, PayPal account or your own Stripe account. Super, super easy. But that's what I recommend. Lawrence Q. So you're telling me I should actually do some work and not just study and consume information for 10 years free? First, stop with the madness. You're funny, man. Oh, well, let's see. Go back. All right. Beyond 3 3. My girlfriend might be upset if I bought this course. Actually, there will be stuff in there that will improve your relationship with your girlfriend. What's up, Roosevelt? All right. Um, not using Patreon. I'm ready. Let's just get rid of him. Bubble is the beast. <laughs> what? Wild Jones report. By the way, I am reselling smartphones on Facebook marketplaces and let go. And this show and showed the home screen of the phone with its apps. Very little response. <clears throat> yeah, that, this is what I'm saying. Start with physical products. I started with physical products for over a decade. It's easier. Uh, selling digital, you can make more money, but people, you know, ask yourself, why should people buy from me? <laughs> ask yourself that question. And if you pause, All right. You got to start using them. Uh, how the wild jump? Then I put in an Instagram photo of a smoking hot woman on the home screen of the smart <laughs> Velo. Hundreds of views and lots of inquiries. I mean, wild Joe's report. You just you just solved the secret there. I'm telling you, um, like the thumbnail on this video. That's going to get a lot of attention. That's going to make people click on this video. <laughs> it is. It just is. It has nothing to do with the video. It's clickbait all day long. Swoopman1972? Sure. And see, this is something else funny. Like, whenever I do some stuff like explaining and Q&A, and, and, and this is for me, because I get people like on Disruptive Mail asking like, hey, how can I get on the site? Hi. This so this is for me. So for the 63 people who are watching, appreciate it because um, part of the game is creating renewable, efficiently efficient instruments like this video. When someone says, hey, how do I copy paste versus going, well, you go here or hit this link. A video is going to work better. Plus, I put this link on the the um, on uh, disruptive mail. They're going to come over here to watch this video. So this is going to increase my session time for disruptive mail. And it's going to get me people to put, it's going to actually start to rescue this channel because I've turned off most of the paid traffic and it didn't drop like I thought it was. Cause I thought it was just going to go boom. But I know that a lot of people from disruptive mail are coming over here and this is what's resurrecting the channel. All right. So no more questions or anything. All right, I will go back to uh, this. All right. So 30 days. And let's see, let's go back. So the best thing that you should get with your 50% off discount is the Never Broke Action Pack. This is the best thing. It's going to get you with the physical products. It's going to teach you the sale and a lot of other stuff. Hands down, best thing. And once again, I am raising the price, but I'm not raising the price during this period where I'm getting disruptive mail prepped together. All right, so let's see, go around here. Aha, let's talk about this. And what's the price on this? Cool. Actually, since no one's really buying this, I can actually raise the price on this. All right. One of the reasons I stopped talking about this and one of the reasons I stopped working on this is you had people who were coming in here looking for solutions 
in the current tax year. This is the current tax year. This is 2018. The strategies of stuff I talk about must be deployed in 2018. You cannot do a lot. Like maybe you can set up a 401k or do an LL, some other high level stuff like that. You can do that, but most of you are not there. So your tax strategy needs to start now. You, you can't wait to the end of the year or like a month before April 15, 16. You, you, you can't. And so there'll be a lot of stuff here. And the reason I just shut up about it was I had people on my ass because they were like looking for stuff and they didn't really understand. It's like, you know, that you had to do this stuff in 2017. It's not going to work. I mean, you, you can't use 2018 stuff for 2017. So I seriously say for you, you need a tax strategy because I put up here on my um, Facebook page that all these people were whining about these big ass checks they have to write. You know why they're writing these big ass checks? Because they're taking a lot of money out the company instead of using the money to grow the company. The Internal Revenue Service tax code works like this. If you make one, like I learned this, the year that I made um, $1.2 million and I I only only pay taxes on like 30 grand because there's all this money went back in the business, you know, and I was like, man, this sucks. I mean, one point two million dollars only brought home 30 grand. And one of my friends, he tried to tell me, he's like, dude, you made money dude. keep this up. Right. And see, I was not really seasoned as I am now because now I know what he meant. But I went into the used furniture, which had more margin. And I operated on a cash basis for many years. So I learned the game that way. But tax stuff, if you have a company and you spend a lot of the money growing the company, you're not going to pay a lot in taxes. And the goal is, is to make the company, which is the asset, more valuable. And then when it gets to the place where it's very valuable, that's when you start pulling money out. Because when you're pulling out big money on your company, you're literally choking it to death. You 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 just don't understand. You like literally got your hands around his neck, just like ah ah ah. But once again, this is why I put up what I put up. I'm actually I'm gonna show y'all what I put up. Let's see, because it shouldn't be too far down. Because I mean, I just saw it whining, and I was like, man, <laughs> y'all don't understand. This isn't how the game is played. Here it is. Here it is. My hustle is elegant. My taxes are low. So are the taxes of the people in the know. Just ask your president. That's how the game is played. That's what you got to do. A lot of people just choking their businesses and killing their business. Like if you have a business that has like a 70 or 80 or 90 percent margin and you taking all that money out, you are killing yourself because one day someone else is going to figure out your business model and they're not going to take out a 70 or 80 percent margin. They're going to take out 20 percent and put the rest of that money in the company and then assassinate you in the marketplace. That's what they're going to do. Just letting you know. Because I am your hustling godfather to try to keep y'all safe keep you little chilling safe all right once again follow me on instagram be sure to do that and let's see if we got any questions <laughs> what's up be real Roosevelt Davis, yes, the thumbnail did make me click, and I said, wow, wow, G is electric at it again. <laughs> uh, Erica P., I sell phones online through OfferUp and let it go, and I make sure I clean the phone screen and back. I also take pictures when the screen is set up. Uh, I got a phone. Let's see, is it on this phone? I guess it should be on this phone. Because, you know, Apple's got this um, serious. Ah, all right. So let's do this. All right, let me come here and I'm going to show you. I got this phone on eBay as we speak. All right, so. All right, I got to go this way. All right, so that these are the actual pictures in the eBay ad. 
because I don't care what you put in the description. They're not going to believe you unless they can see that the phone has no scratches. So that's the actual phone. I, I, you, you put it on a white background. You do it a little quirky to make it stand out in the listings. Incidentally, I have gotten hit with so many of those fake offers. I mean, like 10 of them. And then, you know, it's easy to see because they always offer more money than you're asking as an offer. And I was like, this is stupid. Why don't you just buy the phone? Because, see, they don't want to buy the phone. They want to get your PayPal information and try to hack your account. Let's see. All right. Good deal, Stefan. Art change. I don't know what else to buy. I think I just about purchased everything else. There's kind of nothing left. Awesome. We appreciate you. That's cool. Uh, I ran out of space, but DC is only providing street licenses to food trucks in their in their expansion. Wow. What's up, Dwayne? Uh, ask it. You've asked this question like three times. Just go ahead and spin your 150. <laughs> I'll let you know when it's over. Yes, it's available. What's up, Mentor Shelley? Michael Dennis? Been the bartender. <laughs> Dwayne Bryant, how did you put the business in the debt initially, which allowed you? All right. Koshi, how did you put the business in debt initially, which allowed you to not pay taxes until you were out of debt? Uh, that's a high-level strategy right there. That's a high-level strategy. And I'm not trying to be a dick, but I'm not really discussing that because it's in the course. Because And also, and I'm not discussing it because i got people out here trying to do this stuff, and they don't know all the steps, and they could get in trouble. Essentially, you've got to buy the course to get that information because... That's one, two, three, four, five, six. That's like eight steps of that. So that's one of the things. All right. Let's see what else we're going to go over. Yeah, I'm not. I mean, once again, I'm your hustling godfather. See, this is the thing that I realized. I had a lot of people who would come in, and I'm not saying this because you don't do this, Dwayne. And they'll ask question after question after question to avoid buying the course. And I would tell them. And then... They would go out and do something stupid and they would come back and like, hey, man, that didn't work. I was like, what are you talking about? And I mean, seriously, I got like this eight paragraph hater. Grade. I was like, dude, you really thought I was going to tell you everything for free? Really? So be careful. <laughs> uh, which course is that? All right, let's go through this. Uh, whoa. Well, that's not where I want to be. All right, so let me explain something to y'all. Go here. All right. Now, everything, because I haven't gotten to, around to this because disruptive mail is just taken off, but I will. So you're going to get the Hustle LLC, the path to immediate and long-term wealth. So that's kind of done. That's not done. That's done. That's done. And there's some more courses. And this is kind of why I'm going more to teachable because think of if that just doesn't work, I have to go back this way. But this is where I put the stuff in. This is where I actually give you um, articles of organizations that you can copy and adjust and all this other stuff. I give you this right here. And see, starting March 12, everyone that pays full price, and notice I put full price because if you ain't pulling full price, we're not going to have a conversation. Because right now, uh, once this promotion is over and stuff, I am going to raise this to 2500 Because if you have business, and if you don't have any business and you, you're not making any money, you really don't need this. I know I've just cost myself some money there, but seriously, you should go ahead and get the... Um, which one? Let's come out of this. You should get. Come on. Let's do what we need to do. Here we go. 
until you you should start making some money at the street level first, five hundred to a thousand a month, and then invest in yourself and come on and get some of these higher level courses because. Uh, I had someone who bought the course and then we got on the phone and they didn't have a business. No business whatsoever. Nothing. They ain't going to work. I mean, my role here is to provide you information. My role is to provide you training. Your role is to do the fucking work. Because, see, if I was doing the work, then, you know, we're, we're business partners and I'm going to want a lot more than what I'm charging for these courses. Like, whoa, whoa, I'm doing the work. I done sat down with you. I done told you what product to buy. I done told you this, 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 this. Uh, I'm not going to want like the price of a course. I'm going to want half your profits. Just saying. But hands down, you know, if your money's funny or you don't have any experience, this is what you should get. This is this is what I went through. Let me let me just go ahead and say this and be very arrogant. You ain't me. Now, I know a lot of you out there appreciate me. You buy the courses. You understand. You respect the hustle. And I appreciate you. There's a lot of you that think you're just as smart as me, but you live in the home with your mama. If the results don't line up with what you think, hello? You know, when I was homeless, and I had a conversation with my mom, and my mom said, you can move back in with me. And the way she said it, I know she didn't want my ass there. You know what I said? Nah, I'll just stay out here and figure it out. You're going to need to develop that kind of mentality. No one's coming to save your ass. No one's going to help you without wanting something from you. This is real life. This is what you need to do. This is what you need to put into play. An action plan to be your own Superman. Because like I said, there's a lot of you who respect the hustle. You buy the courses. You And this is something else, too. People who buy the courses actually come in the comments and say, wow, this is the truth. Wow, I'm making money. But y'all still want some fancy professional lie of a testimonial because you've been indoctrinated and trained. Mm hmm. Yeah, I, I'm telling you, most of them are staged and fake. Most of them. You know how like eBay, how many of you do eBay? How many people leave positive feedback now? It used to be in the early days of eBay. Firstly, everyone did. Then it went to like 50%, stayed that way for a long time. Now, if you don't leave them feedback, they definitely not going to leave you feedback. And like I said, my feedback is 32. I've sold like 100 products. So it's about 30%. And that's just on eBay. You know, it's very hard to get testimonials out of people. That's why the folks who love the channel, who love the courses, who get results, and you put the stuff in the comments, I say, thank you. I'm not going to sit here and ask your ass for a testimonial that, you know, or my favorite, people giving testimonials before they even do the course. Like, I just bought the course. This is amazing. Where are your results? I'm just saying. Uh, pretty much Roosevelt I don't even know who that is Archangel been the bartender eBay I never leave feedback I mean that it is what it is honey bunny I get feedback on eBay maybe once or twice a month they don't come through unless they're super pleased or super angry. And being the bartender, people who are getting results aren't going to tell what their hustle is. Human nature, man. Human nature. Awesome. Awesome. I'm going to just say A-R-A because -A, I can't pronounce your name. Every day I get results. Top of the morning. Top of the morning, you mo grizzly. Uh, I should start adding people next week to the platform. So, because the the offer is from last Friday up until I cut it off. So, you can still get it. GT Abrams. I'm interested in never be broke in the LLC. Do I get 50% off and get the lifetime mail to risk this? this <laughs> All right, hold on. Uh, GTA Abrams, I'm interested in the Never Be Broke Action Pack in the LLC. Do I get the 50% off and get the lifetime mail disruptive? 
even if I'm not male? Yes. If you buy the Hustler LLC today and get 50% off, and you buy the Never Broke Action Pack today and get 50% off, even if you're a female, I will add you to Disruptive Male Prep. I should warn you, there will be shocking, damn near pornographic content in there. And it's, it may blow your mind, but hey, if you you make the purchase, yeah, I'm going to throw you off in there. I'm not discriminating. I mean, it's going to, because see, with Disruptive Male Prep, well, Disruptive Male, my uh, watchers over there are like 99.1% male. So I've got some females coming over there. That's cool. You know, if you're female, come on in. But I'm just telling you, it's going to be shocking. It's going to be very, very shocking. But yes, you will get all that if you come in. Uh, Dwayne Bryant, Coach G, you're right. It's them. Robert Kilosaki, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, and the likes who be lying to people, giving off the impression that it's money going to jump into their bank accounts. Pretty much. Rich Dad, Poor Dad. That title is brilliant. It's just brilliant. It communicates so much. But... It should be working dad versus a dad who has a business who has people to work for him. Very clunky title, but that's what it happens. That's what's going. That's that's the real deal to make things happen. Adult material. Yeah, because like I said, I'm not ready to make the announcement just yet. I may not make the announcement on disruptive mail prep, but there's going to be some stuff in there that will literally shock you and blow your mind. I will put pictures as well. Uh, I got a few videos I can share, too. So that's going to be there. And it's going to blow your mind. I'm just letting you know. Uh, oh, it was either a channel. OK, I got you. I got you. What's up, Simp uh, Kevin? I don't know what that is. Have you changed your setup at all? The stream is looking super crisp. It's moved this morning. You want to know why? I'll show you why. I didn't change a lot of stuff. That's why <laughs> it's looking super crisp. You won't. Well, let's see. Let's shed a little light on it. Lighting is very, very important. So that's why. I'm doing it with a DSLR. So, yeah, <laughs> I've changed it. That's like $1,200 camera right there. Once again, I'm investing in the business. Last year, I spent, wow, 50 k on, this is a brand new, it's almost like a Mac Pro. It's got like 64 gigabytes i7 chip. I got three of those. I got the laptop. I got this camera. I got another camera that's like three grand. I've got... I, I spent close to 50 G's just on equipment and stuff. This is what you got to do, man. So thanks, Kevin. I'm going to call you Kevin. <laughs> Honey Bunny, it's rough being a female over a disruptive male, but I watch the streams because I'm raising a son and I want him to be ahead of the game by the time he's a man. Awesome. Because like I said, uh it's funny. My girl and I were having this conversation this morning. And she's like, she doesn't watch it. She's just like that. That's just so brutal. But she says, all you're doing is telling the truth. That's all I'm doing. I am not making up nothing. I'm just telling the truth because I've been through a lot. And, um, oh, hi, Sheena, because I know your bitch ass still watching. And that's something else, too. The channel draws so many angry people. But the dudes like it because when I speak of what happened to me, I'm telling their story as well. Because when I did that, single moms are the worst uh, parents ever for, for an alpha male. The, there was a dude. I'm not going to mention his name. He can pop in here and tell his story. He's talking about he was almost suicidal over that stuff. The man was almost suicidal because of what his mom did to him. There ain't nobody. I mean, you know, you got, you know, shout out to O'Shea Duke Jackson. You got him out there doing something for men and the, the um, Negro Man of Spear. But there ain't a lot of resources out here for us. And Disruptive Mail is going to be one of them. I'm going to be unapologetic. I'm going to just put that stuff in there because secrets makes cowards of all of us. Like my, my issue with the child support. 
I came out here and told it. A lot of people been like, I ain't going to tell that child support. I don't want people to think I'm a deadbeat dad. But see, I got to tell my story and give the narrative. I'm not a deadbeat dad. We agreed to joint custody. We agreed to share it custody. I was going to keep her during the days. She was going to keep her at night. No money. But her mama, you drive a BMW. You need to give us some money. That bitch infiltrated her head and she started thinking of how much money she would get. And she completely disregarded what was going to be in the best interest of Madison. Because see, this is what would have happened. I would have had her and we would have developed a super close relationship. Super close. Because the thing is, I had made decisions in my life that gave me the time to watch a kid. She didn't. And she was jealous of that. She was jealous that I was going to spend more time with Madison than she was. So she just made sure it didn't happen. Therefore, screwing Madison over. Because I know you're watching. And it's going to come a day when she's going to like, where's dad? And you're going to tell her these lies. And then she's going to grow up some more. And she's going to come find me. And she's going to ask me. And I'm be like, court papers. Uh, I actually carved, I actually recorded a lot of these conversations on CD-ROM. Listen to this, listen to this, listen to this. Uh, Madison, I'm really sorry what happened to you because I know you got fucked. But I really would have been deeply, deeply proud to be your father. But because your mother, I didn't want her sexually. I didn't want her as a partner. And she just said, you don't get me, you don't get her, you don't get Madison. That's what happened. That's what I'm going to tell her. And it's going to be the truth. And I'm going to have so much evidence She's going to actually believe me. And I wonder where that's going to leave your bitch ass. I really do. Because I am hands off. What's that saying? When you love something, let it go and see if it returns to you. That's where I'm at. Because this thing is going to stay the way it is until you get a case of act right. Oh, yeah. Stop calling my number with all these unknown phone calls. What you need to do is send me a text unblocked because I'm going to tell you real quick. The only way that we're going to work this out is you move your funky ass back to Georgia because I'm not doing part time parenting. You know, pay you child support 12 months out the year, see her once, twice a year. That shit ain't happening. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to be a father. You know, our father's role is to nurture, uh, to protect, to be there, to teach. So essentially, you've reduced me to. Someone like an uncle, she gets to see once or twice a year if I was to engage in the fuckery that you're trying to present to me. Because I already know what you're trying to do. It ain't going to work. Also, for any of you who are curious about the power of the Hustler LLC, if she could get at me, she would. If that ain't a testament to how good that information is, I don't know what it is. I'm going through it right now. She can't get at me. She can't get any money. Well, I don't have any money because I don't own anything. I just control a lot. Because, see, this is how the law works. They come after me, not the company that's not owned by me. So you can do the right thing or you can keep being a stupid bitch. And I wonder if your grandmother is telling you that to your face. Because when we were going up those stairs that cold December night, and she said, I know she's my granddaughter, but she's just stupid. I wonder if she's telling you that since Jackie's gone. Yeah, I know that because a friend of mine peeped your page and found out your mother died like I predicted. Because I remember when I wrote you that letter and I said, they're going to die one day and it's just going to be you. What you going to do? Looks like a lot of the stuff I say is coming true. Are you going to be a woman or are you going to keep being a trick? You got my number. Use it the correct way. Stop doing all this bitch ass cowardly trick shit. So from me to you. <clears throat> All right. Let's see. <laughs> More grizzly. I'm not angry. <laughs> oh, man. I just looked at my drawing of my customer and said, this motherfucker doesn't look like they typed to pay 300 to have the windows of his house clean. Wow. Archangel, right. Let's the haters hate the words. Gee, you need to give me. You should give me. They just do something to me. I know. Swoopman1992. They're mad because you're telling the truth, G. I ended up homeless because of the child support. But now I have a business going strong. Thanks, Glendon. You're the truth. A lot of men go through a lot with this. But see, we're supposed to be quiet about it. 
It ain't happening. Uh, BT the career boss man Glennon. My brothers, how to keep educating the brothers. Ben the bartender, sad truth. A lot of relationships, some aren't grown enough to make the best decisions for the child. Nope. Well, no, you don't have to get a vasectomy. You just have to get the right kind of woman. Because, once again, I believe in an abundance mindset. And I think her silly ass is almost at her breaking point. Maybe she got triggered by this conversation. I don't know. Because until she does the right thing, the adult thing. Oh, yeah. You will put in the text that we will have shared custody. No back child support. No child support. Ain't happening. Because you breached the contract through violence. I got the police report to prove it. You could have been arrested that night. And God is my witness. I wish I had arrested you. I wish I had them arrest you. Because we've been going through this right now. Uh, Mentor Shelly, it's a shame that the immaturity is going to cause your, your child pain down the line. What's best for your child is most important. Real parents are mature. Amen, Mentor Shelly. Real parents, not childish tricks. Arsis, what if you already own your home free and clear? Can the system take that away? Depends on what's coming. Like, um, if you have an asset like that, I would get it into an LLC. Because, well, if you don't have any issues, you don't have any things, no one's suing you. No, no one's going to happen. But if you own it free and clear and uh, let's not duplicate into both parties worthy. <laughs> what the hell? Homie, boy, strap up. She may go after you, homie. <laughs> Dwayne Bryant, disclaimer, simps assistive single mother should leave now and get a colony. I mean, seriously, it didn't have to go this far. She allowed, I may let, I may let y'all hear how this uh, bitch's mother talked to me. I think I will do that because I recorded a lot of stuff because I knew there would come a day that I would need this because essentially, you know, if you're going through some stuff like this, record it, take out your cell phone, record it. Because one day when the child's like, dad, what happened? They ain't nothing better than hearing it and seeing it in live action and knowing that their mother did not have their best interests in heart because she was about petty shit. I know you're watching. I know. I don't know because I know you subscribe to the channel. And thanks to my mod team, you can't get in here and be disruptive. I know you're watching. And it's really sad because it didn't have to be like this way. But you want to play this way? Fine. Fine. But. You will never, ever get at me until you do the right thing. And you know what that is. All right. Let's see. Honey, buddy, I don't know if this has been asked, but what is your stance on prenups to protect your existing assets not tied to an LLC if your goal is to get married? Prenups are invalidated every day. Let's say you get a woman to sign a prenup. Say a month before the wedding, you say, hey, sign this prenup. She signs it. If she doesn't go out and get due diligence done, another attorney to look at it, that can invalidate that prenup right there. <laughs> if there are kids involved, they can invalidate that prenup. The only way that you can protect yourself is to put into play LLCs, have your assets there before you get married, before you have kids. Now, my situation is a little different because I made a declaration in 2012 right here on youtube that i was going to put my intellectual property into a trust for my kids uh, madison was born 2013 so i have proof of my intent so that's what helped me because hey you know we'll see because i don't know why she's calling from a block number like a child i, I have no clue and i'm not answering like yesterday i was trying to turn it off I had a feeling it was you. Uh, Mentor Shelley, my husband is going through some similar situation with his children's mother, so I understand it from both perspectives. Essentially, what it is, is often the dude is okay, but the woman isn't okay with him being okay. <laughs> That's really what it is. Archie and G always talk about this, like with Hustler Porn. Everyone loves the visual ideal of managing a successful life. 
Cars, clothes, everyone loves you instead of the vision of all the hard work and service. Damn, Skippy. Dang, hate is the new love. Beatology, don't ever... Uh, Beatology, that's not... I don't think like that, man. Um, I don't think that you should suffer. If you're a man and you want to have a family, get you the right woman to have your family. You want a girlfriend, get your girl. I am not, like, once again, I am not beating up on the mid toe guys. I know what it's like. I've been through it, so I got mad respect for you. But as an option of personal choice, if you want to get married, get married. Just get your ass up in disruptive mail so you can test her. <laughs> Make sure that the goods are what the goods say they are. Make sure the merchandise is authentic. You got to test them, bros. You got to test them before some jumps off. Because when some jumps off and they're untested, hmm. <sighs> <laughs> uh, Charles Hall what if you're already married you better make beautiful love to your wife <laughs> you better keep her happy <laughs> alright <laughs> I'm about to go so essentially just go below make sure that you get on the email list well the uh, text notification list and you will be getting text to both of these sets of live streams and the best thing to buy is the never broke action pack that's going to give you the most bang for your buck give you some ideas tips training to get yourself situated then after you make some money come back and get the hustler llc and what i'll do and you're gonna to have to remind me this but whatever you spend now i'll deduct that from the hustlers llc so because the hustlers llc is going to be 2500 but say you spend a thousand dollars now I will take $1,000 off of the Hustler LLC when you're ready for it. That's right. So as you progress and get your money up, I will help you. But you got to fucking work. <laughs> you got to do the work. All right. Be good. Subscribe. Leave stuff in the comments. And I will see you people later.